Hello everyone, today we're going to be looking at Lead Gourmet, 1 liter capacity, glass cordless electric kettle. Now let me show you the box first, then I will unbox it and set it up and show you how it works. Heats faster and safer than a microwave and stovetop. Auto shut off, boil dry protection, cord free serving with 360 rotational base. And here is the model number and let me show you the other side. Large pouring spout, liter and cup markings. So it has both of those illuminated blue interior light, easy one touch pop-up lid, simple on and off switch, cool touch handle and cord free serving. Now let's see how this thing looks. Now let's, now the first thing inside the box, we do have the instructional manual. So if you never used kettle before, definitely check this out. And it's a few pages, how to use, and there's also cleaning and maintenance. Let's put that on the side. And let's pull the kettle out. And let me see if there's anything else. No, nothing else inside the box. Let's put that aside. Let's check the base first and check how long the cord is. So here's the cord. So we have about, I would say about three feet. And let's check the kettle itself. It looks very cute. It's small, but not too small. So we have 0.3 liters, which is 1.3 cups. That's the minimum you have to add. And we have 0.6 liters, two and a half cups, and the max is one liter, four and a half cups. Make sure you don't go over this max because once it starts boiling, it might drip out. So it's never a good idea to go over it. On the bottom, here's some more specs. This is 1100 watts. Now on the base, make sure you adjust the cable. And all right, so once we have that, once we have that cable inside the hole. And now let's see how this thing attaches itself. So all you have to do is just find the middle and it just attaches itself. So pretty cool. Let's see how easy it is to do it. Once you do it once or twice, it just goes back inside the hole. And you can actually swirl it 360. So for example, you can put it in one way and then once you take it off, if you're on the other side, you can take it off. Now let's check the handle. It does have on and off button. What you have to do is pretty much turn it on because it has that automatic shut off. It will turn itself off automatically. And here we have the button that opens up the lid. Now the lid itself goes all the way up to 90 degrees. So you can add the water easily. And also you can put your hand inside and clean it if you need to. One last thing I wanted to show you before I forget, it has this little mash on the front. So for example, if you're boiling a tea with all the herbs and, and as you pour it into the cup, none of those herbs will actually get inside your cup, which is a really smart thing. I actually love that. All right, so I have about a one liter of water. I'm about to turn it on. And I will also time it to see how long it takes. It has this really cool blue LEDs. I think it looks amazing, especially in the dark. And already in less than two minutes, we can see some bubbles going to the top. All right, so we're getting close to the five minute mark. And as you guys can see, the water just started boiling. So it takes about five minutes from very cold to boiling water. Now I will wait to see when the auto shut off will happen. But at five minutes, we're getting the boiling water. Let's see how long it takes for the machine to auto shut off. And just like that, it only took 10 seconds between the boiling and auto shut off. Now, cool thing about this is you don't even have to lift the top to pour it. And as I told you guys, there's that mash. There's that mash on the front. So all you have to do is just pour it. 
if you're making tea and look at that no drip no spill nothing now you can just place it back on thank you guys for watching